welcome again today we are going to discuss gradient tools gradient tools are least used by the designers who are developing applications or design the applications using expressions blend for the quick demo I would use a rectangle let me draw a rectangle on my screen there you go and I have selected here the gradient brush now I would just color the gradient endpoints or you might say the nodes of the gradient color gradient brush I would give one of them yellow and second of them a bit grayish okay that's cool so now I have a gradient color on my rectangle so next thing what I'm going to do is that I'm going to use a set of tools that is basically prescribed for the gradient color or the gradient brush. So here is a set of tool for the gradient color. The very first one is the gradient tool. By using the gradient tool what I can do is that I can transform my gradient accordingly. I can change the direction and even though I can change the intensity of the gradient color and there you go where next tool I'm just going to discuss is the gradient transform tool that comes under the gradient tool and let's try that right click on the gradient tool and click on the brush transform now what brush transforms do is that it gives you an imaginary rectangle or imaginary shape of your control and you can relocate the very shape and it also relocates the very gradient so if you want more intensity of yellow move downwards more intensity of black move upwards and respectively vice versa you can do a lot of things with that even you can rotate that and you can do a lot of things with this so these are the basic gradient tools that people do not use while designing their application using expressions blend but they are really amazing set of tools for defining the gradient colors and for managing and maneuvering the gradient brushes